Hey traders, a quick heads up here on net gas, gold, silver and crude oil starting with natural gas. So what do we have right here? Now if the price pushes up, hit 50 EMA again, in that case I'm expecting another bearish candle and another fall. If you follow me from a couple of months or a year, you know that I never take my buy trades unless and until the price is above 50 EMA or unless and until price hit the area of value which in this case is my level of support. Yes, that would be a bearish signal and that as, as I've mentioned that I will see how the market will open it opens in gap up so that is why i decided not to enter in this trade but that would be a valid condition as well so now i'm still paying attention for my selling opportunities now if the next candle is a bearish candle we have a bearish signal something like this and as you can see the price is trading in a very nice downtrend and trading below 50 ema and 20 EMA. 50 EMA is very important. As you can see, we had a move like this and price rejected from here. So that is what I want to see here. A bearish candle will be your sell signal again and we will go short using one ATR for your target and then manage it accordingly. So keep an eye here for your condition. I will only buy if we have a break above 50 EMA with at least two green candles. In that case, I will look for my buying opportunities with a pullback followed by a bullish engulfer and I will go long till the price hit the next level right up here. So keep an eye here. I'm still looking for sell conditions with a bearish engulfer. Once we have that, we're good to go short here on currency.com. And uh, right here, as you can see, a valid signal would, would be a green candle right here. And the very next candle must be a red bearish engulfing candle. If that happens, we are good to go short. So this candle must closed as a green candle doesn't matter if it looks like a doji as long as the color looks green to you and then the next candle is a bearish candle in that case we are good to go short till this zone here which is 2.141 that goes down to 2.016 a zone from where we will enter buy trade the whole zone is my buying area from where i'll be entering my buy trade so not buying unless and until price hit the zone here or it breaks above 50 ema and then i will look for pullbacks followed by bullish in golfer and i will then go long so keep an eye here for your conditions let's check gold Right, so gold did not break and close below this zone with two good two red candles and price just pushed up from here. Now at this point, I'm still waiting for the price to break above 50 EMA. If that happens, we have a good change of trend and price will likely to push up from here. We have a very minor resistance, which is 1979, goes up to 18, 1984, from where we can expect some pullbacks before the price can likely to push up. So wait for the price to break above 50 EMA only, then I'll start to look for my buy trade, not selling unless and until price is completely broken below this low. In that case, the price will go bearish and we only look for sell opportunities. For now, no signal for gold. The signal will happen only once the price will break above 50 EMA for the buy signal with a pullback or retest of this zone and then a push up from here. So wait for the conditions. Patience is very important. Enter your trade with patience and conditions only. Right, so we have silver here and right here as you can see price formed a bullish in golfer but that is not a valid condition. I look for my trades in case you're wondering but price is still above 50 EMA so for now I want to see another good green candle that must close above 50 EMA. We already have one candle. I want to see one more candle close above 50 EMA. In that case I will look for the pullbacks followed by bullish in golfers and then keep on taking long until the price hit this level above in red and from here I will see if I get a sell signal to take my sell trade. So buying once we have a one more green candle pullback bullish in golfer till this area of value if we have no signal here no rejection here break and close above this top in that case the price will turn bullish till the price hit the upper level of resistance which is 24 point six zero so that is what i'm looking at for silver let's check crude oil so we have a new zones for crude oil if you want to mark these zones on your charts right here a 76.62 goes up to 78.93 a zone from where i want to enter my sell trades only price is nicely trading above 50 and 20 ema both so we can get a good pullback till 50 ema followed by a bullish engulfer and then we will go another long so not selling crude oil as long as price is now above 50 and 20 ema unless and until we hit this zone above and once the price hit this zone we will enter our trade with bearish engulfers or with double top entry pattern so keep an eye here once we have a condition we are good to go short from here long with bullish in golfer above 50 ema so that is it for commodities guys any questions any confusions you can always dm in instagram i'll get back to asap hope you trade green the rest of the week see you guys in the next video till then take care